Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. It's been a while, but I'm back and I'm ready to jump into these videos. You know, I was just sitting around and I was just thinking, whew, I'm so glad that's over. Why you ask? There's some things that they don't tell you about being pregnant, but I'm here to tell you. And not that cute, you know, oh, this is wonderful. This is me and you, girlfriend to girlfriend, and I'm going to let you know. There are some things that they have left out of the movies. So, we've all seen the movies. What's the major complaints? Oh, I have morning sickness, which you do have. Oh, I'm so emotional. I have oh. swollen ankles. I have a little bit of heartburn. And I'm uncomfortable. Aww. Let's get into real life, honey. Morning sickness. Who named it morning sickness? Because you have it all day. I'm talking about morning sickness, afternoon sickness, night sickness, all day sickness. It is absolutely horrible. And nothing helps. Ginger ale, ginger gum, sea bands, vinegar, salt and vinegar chips, like nothing totally helped. I was nauseous all the time, all the time. Okay, constipation. Constipation is real. I'm just gonna leave that right here for you. Heartburn. I don't mean just regular heartburn. After you eat something spicy. No, I mean, your heart, your chest is on fire heartburn all the time. <laughs> all the time. They tell you, oh, sit up. Oh, take an antacid. No, my heartburn was like, take that antacid. Sitting up did nothing. Nothing. Being uncomfortable is an understatement. Okay? I mean, everything hurts. Your ankles, your knees, your back. Everything. You can't even get in a comfortable position. It hurts to walk. It hurts to sit. It hurts to lay. It just hurts. And guess what? You have to suck it up because it's a part of pregnancy. It's a part of pregnancy. What? That's what the doctors tell you. Get some more pillows. It'll be okay. What? Shortness of breath. And I don't mean just when you're walking. I mean when you do anything. I don't know if you know, but everything that's in your abdomen rises up into your chest so that the baby can have room, which means everything is up here where your lungs are supposed to be. And that's why you're like, <gasps> I felt like I should have weighed like 500 pounds, okay? I was just out of breath. No joke. Pressure. And I don't mean peer pressure. Let's talk about the pressure of the baby sitting on your... The baby feels like it's going to fall off your butt at any moment, okay? At any moment. I just knew she was going to fall out. It was so much pressure down there. It was like a bowling ball sitting on the inside, okay? Who knew seven pounds felt that heavy? Like seriously, when you lift up like a little dumbbell, it's like five pounds or, you know, a 10 pound dumbbell and it's like, oh, it's no, no. Try carrying that inside you for nine months. They don't tell you about this. Where are my real friends? Now, we all know your body does some weird things. We know this. And it did this, I think, with my son. It did, it did it with my son. However, this time around, it was more extreme. Let's talk about dark nipples. Dark nipples. And I don't mean just a little pigmentation. I mean dark, like almost black. Okay? And I'm a brown-skinned girl, you know? So, dark nipples was something new for me. Leaking boobs. I knew that your boobs would leak when you start to breastfeed. Who knew that your boobs would leak before the baby got here? And it did it in the most awkward place. I was in Target. I was leaning over the, the shopping cart. 
And when I stood up, my shirt was wet. Talk about embarrassing moments. Now, don't get me wrong. Pregnancy is a wonderful, wonderful thing. If it wasn't, I wouldn't have done it again. But there are some things that I wish my good girlfriends would have sat down and told me. So, if you just found out you're pregnant, or you hope to be soon, don't say I didn't warn you. Come back to this video and watch it again. So that way you're prepared, ready, because your body is about to do some weird, weird things. But guess what? You're gonna love it, and it's gonna be worth it. So, it was nice talking to you guys. And if you wanna keep up with what I'm doing, click the subscribe button below, and I'll see you soon.